I came up to the town of Livingston, Texas because I had a gig at Temp Creek Vineyard. Livingston is located 75 miles northeast of Houston, and it's got a population of about 6,000 people in Livingston proper. There's also a place just west of it called West Livingston that's got uh, 8,000 folks or so. And this is a place where you could really get away from Houston, and you can sense that you're in a different place. There's a lot of trees and a lot of nature around here, and so you can find some relaxation from that big city life. Now, downtown Livingston has got the square. It's all centered around the Polk County Courthouse. They even got a little gazebo there next to the courthouse. So you can have a good rock around there, uh, especially on one of these lazy, misty weekend days. You can find those cool looking storefronts uh, with a lot of those brick buildings that look really unique. Very old school look about that place where you can find those antiques and treasures and desserts just walking around. Some of the key things around there, of course, is they got that water tower with the town's name on it. They got some words of encouragement for you right there on the wall. And they got some history right up there on the wall. And they got a chair for you to sit on and take some photos on. One of the places for music right here in Livingston, which I've been told about by multiple people and recommended, is called Across the Tracks. Kind of an intimate BYOB kind of place that features original songwriters, so it looks really cool. Hope to check it out one day. Now, looking for food, I found the Courthouse Whistle Stop Cafe. Gotta love the Whistle Stop Cafe with a very uh, original, homey kind of vibe to it. And it's inside this cafe where you can get the real dialect of the folks here. I think of all the small town Texas places I've been to, Livingston is the most notable in terms of folks having a distinct Texan accent. So I got a good old omelet there at the Whistle Stop Cafe. And I had some time to check out Lake Livingston State Park to get some real relaxation there. And I thought it was really peaceful, again, because it was kind of overcast and uh, misty out there. It was nice to just stare at that big old lake and think about the folks who are living around that lake. Now technically this is a reservoir, and technically this is the second largest lake that's entirely within the state of Texas. So that's pretty cool. Pretty big. You can find some kayaks out there. Folks come here to do some fishing, some camping, some picnicking, and I heard there could be a gator or two around here too. Ultimately, I made it up to the gig at Temp Creek Vineyard. This was a really cool and relaxing setting. They call themselves the Boutique Wine Shop and Tasting Room. They got the vineyard right there, and they got some cows right there too. So folks can hang out and drink their wine with those little heaters right there. We had a good uh, attentive audience coming out on this day, and I enjoyed playing some music for these folks. The pretty girls that know how to dance with their hands so many chances. Hanging out there at the side of the bar won't be sitting long too long. So thanks for checking out this video. I'm posting all about the music scene and uh, touring around Texas, so be sure to check out the tons of videos on my YouTube channel. Hit the subscribe and the bell button to stay tuned on my posts here. Let me know in the comments where else I need to check out. <laughs>